first thing you're going to need is your 3 liter calibrating syringe. The adapter on the end looks like this. When you get your transducer here, pull everything off of it, including the white adapter on the end so that this can fit tight and without leaks. You go to the flow sensor calibration page. F1, you're going to hit to start, and the machine's going to immediately tell you what to do. That message will come up. It wants you to flush it with two syringe strokes. Two syringe strokes. So that's what we're going to do. Then you just hit space bar to continue. Now the machine is zeroing it out. All you can do is wait. This is what we do when we wait. There's more waiting. But stuff is happening. <laughs> okay. Are you done yet? No, it's not. Okay. When you first try to pull the syringe back, it isn't going to want to go, so just do a little tug at it and it'll be fine. You have these landmarks. First stroke with any of it, it's not going to count. The machine doesn't even register it, so just go in and out at your pace. Now we're going to try and keep them between the lines. First stroke is going to stay slow and in the first little very narrow pathway. Then you want to go back the same way. Takes a lot of patience. Not always a good thing to do when you feel impatient. This is really the hardest line to get, but just try and keep most of the cowl in the yellow spot. Then we'll get our gradually accelerating flow rates. Now see the last thing's got these last two, the top and the first middle one there. And you think after this you're done, but you're not. It's got a second screen. This screen comes up, same thing. You get two freebies. Now we're going to give it varying flow rates, stay with the very, very slow one first. And back that way. Go, go, go. the red line, super fast, not quite as fast, a little faster than that, and now done. Hit F5 and that prints your test. Flow calibration is done.